Hello. Welcome to RVMAX.US video. We do a lot of uh, motorhome sell, but look at this trade we got here. It's a blast from the past. We used to sell this Trailman a brand new back in uh, about 10 years ago or so. This is a 2002, about 16 year old trail manor, uh, 2619, made out of all aluminum body. We're gonna show you in this video how they open up, how they set up. They're like a travel trailer, but they're kind of like a pop-up without any canvas. So 26 stands for when it's opened up and 19 feet when it's closed down. Well, some of the trailers, they came with a little a detachable pin. So you turn this V a tongue around and it will become 17 feet so you could put in your garage if you live in a restricted neighborhood HOA would not allow you to have a trailer in your driveway or you just want to simply put in a trailer uh, in the garage you could put a 17 foot trailer down so uh, alright so without further ado let me show you how this thing it's got four uh, travel locks alright I'm gonna open up two on the other side real quick All right, they have a, by the way, they do have a leveling jack, so stabilizer jack, what you call. And then they have a two stoppers here. One's open. Let's see, another one's here. All right, now, same way on the other side. And that's it. So, four of them. All right, now what I'm going to do, take a look at this. All right, it's got a little LP tank cover. We'll take that off here and check this out. Let's see, this thing opens up first. So you just kind of like a trunk of the car. You just walk back and it opens up. All right, now we're going to go on the other side, lift that open. So you kind of grab it from middle here and simply walk back. So the system it works on, it's a like a car, a torsion bar. It's like a spring-loaded torsion bar. So they come back and, all right, now I'm gonna kind of lock in place, but I'll tell you what, before I do that, I gotta make sure I'm already up all the way, okay? We put this four uh, pins, it's like a little adjustment stuff. I just did it on four sides. Sometimes you need a little help of another person. We got a leaning parking lot, so you know. All right, let me show you quickly a door. By the way, you see the little bit of aluminum. It's got a little bit of roughness right here, but not a big deal. It is a 16-year-old trailer. All right, let me show you how this door is made. So uh, it's it's like it's plugged in like here when you drive. So pull this thing out. Put the Velcro down here, and. Let's see. This door comes out. And, all right, so now it's in. You close this door and put this little plastic latch down. And now you have a solid door with a dead bolt. How about that? We got this steps down. Now let me go inside and show you how things are set up inside, okay? All right, let's go inside. Before we go inside, I want to tell you there's a spare wheel. It's brand new. Uh, leveling jacks are in really good shape, or if you call them uh, stabilizer jacks. And uh, got outside power for tailgating, suburban heat. All right, we got tires are 26 of uh, 17, so they're less than a year old. They're brand new. Looks like a wheel and tire. They probably, so previous owner took care of it really well, whoever traded it in. Uh, so, uh, all right, let's go inside and I'm going to show you real quick. Uh, let's see, it's got the uh, outside porch light. It's here. Yep, it works. See, uh, nice porch light. Now, you could put some awnings here. I think they had awning. They must have taken it off. That's why I see this little tape that you could put awning here outside. It doesn't have one, but you could put one in. All right, so let's come in. I'm going to show you real quick. It's, it's really neat. You see this thing right here? It goes out. Now, you can pull it from outside. Or, and this side, look at this. This is another bed. Now, you can do that from outside. They have a handle on the outside. All right, here's a wardrobe. It just goes up like that, and you just slide it in. That's it. All right, so now I'm going to show you the bed, how the bed works. All right, so now you lift this up. All right. Uh, I come in here and we'll show you. It's got one latch here. 
put it on and now you got a solid uh, door for the bathroom. Over here, I'm going to lift this up. And there we go. And over here, let's see, I'll get this flap inside. It's got a one little latch here. So now you got a solid wall and one more latch here. And now come take a look at this. We got a solid wall shower. Uh, you could get one of this and have it installed right here for taking a shower. It's a nice little bathtub. Got a marine type toilet. A uh, little sink behind here. Wow, the water pump is very strong. It, 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 no leaks in it. Little cabinet. Cabinet here. It's got a fan. That fan works. Yep, it's got a little fan, like an exhaust fan. A uh, little window here. Oh. Uh, this thing's probably out of its uh, little, it's got to be put back in, but it's got a little curtain here. Now, I think previous owner did all this, nice little, uh, so uh, unlike pop-up, no canvas, okay? It's all solid. They also did, uh, let me turn some lights on here. All right. I'm going to turn the air conditioning on, too. Uh, I think let's get a power on first. All right, so we've got air condition right here. A uh, little drawer. Oh, by the way, a uh, face removable CD player. Got some uh, closet. I mean, a uh, little cupboards. Oh, by the way, all the books and owner's manuals are right here. Uh, so I have a little coat closet, as you see here. Some more drawers. So one bed back here with three windows. By the way, those front window and a rear window has a shade that opens up. It's a metal shade, uh, kind of like an awning. All right, so uh, let's see. Come this way. We have a, a three-burner gas stove, traditional oven. We got a little bit of a storage here, six-gallon hot water heater, water pump on, on and off. You got a level. It's got a refrigerator fan. A uh, refrigerator works on AC, DC, or uh, I think it's a two-way AC, like on a power when you're plugged up at the campground, or also works on LP gas. We haven't tried on an LP, but it should. It works on AC. We turned it on last night, and it's it's working really good. The radio plays really good. Let's see. He's got a couple of speakers there. Is coming to Greenville. All right. So uh, got a little kitchen counter. We got sink. Again, the water pump is very strong and it works. Uh, some of the models we used to sell had a hanging cabinet here that you could put it down. But you know this one don't have one. Uh, this thing weighs only like uh, let's see. Uh, unloaded vehicle weight is 2,785 pounds. That's under 3,000 pounds. You can pull it with a Honda minivan, Toyota minivan. I mean, you, you know, and a, a loaded weight is 4,023 pounds. So very, very light weight. It's all made out of a aircraft grade aluminum uh, sandwich with the styrofoam in the middle of it. So look, we could probably glue this thing up. It's got a few little flaws, uh, not a big deal. Okay, it's probably wires going down or something. Uh, uh, flaps are put down. Uh, they could be cleaned up a little bit. Uh, you know, it's not a brand new trailer, but I think someone reupholstered all this. Uh, got some storage under there. Let me turn this music off. Uh, there's some storage under there. As you can see there, that's all right. Uh, and this thing also turns in a bed. Let me show you how that happens. And this is a lightweight. Everything is lightweight. Uh, so you push this back become small also you can let's see short this and uh, you can put this thing behind the back I think somehow or another yes it goes like that and you can fold it down here 
So now you got a living room with the two sofas. Also, this thing folds out in the night and it becomes bed wall to wall. So you got a bed here, two person can sleep here, two here, two there. You could sleep, depending on the size of adult, four to six uh, easily. And with the kids, you can throw in, you know, I don't know, six or seven. Uh, but uh, so we got air conditioning. It does have a, I think, 15K heat or 10K. That's plenty to run you out of here. Uh, got, they put nice wood floor here. Looks like a laminated floor. Uh, let's see what else I can talk about. Uh, so uh, these were sold for like $25,000 back in the days. Uh, my dealer cost was close to $21,000 on this thing. They're, uh, so they're hard to find. So don't judge this by book value. So when you call us, keep in mind they're hard to find. This is a pop-up, but it's a hard shell travel trailer. When it opens up, it's 26 feet. When it goes down, it's 19 feet. With the tongue, swings around, becomes only 17 feet and under 3,000 pounds. Um, I love this little trailer. So uh, without further ado, uh, let me give you my phone number. Well, I'm going to have uh, my daughter be answering phone on this one. 864-569-5637. The number again is 864-569-5636. Please call her. We prefer text communication. If you don't know how to text, call her and leave her a voicemail and we'll get, she'll get back to you. I'll get back to you. We'll show you this trailer and bring your little Jeep. Like we have this six cylinder Jeep, bring your little minivan and tow it away. If you got a big truck, be at it. But this is only 2,700 pound lightweight trail manor, 2619, 2002 model and uh good shape uh and we're gonna check hot water heater we already checked the water operation and we'll we'll hand you key of this trailer and you can go camp thank you for watching the video the number one more time is 864-569-5636 thank you and have a great day